It is hard to avoid the sun during summer in Texas, North Texas. A few statistics about skin cancer, though, could make you reach for a tube of sunscreen pretty fast. Skin cancer is the most common form of cancer. One in every five Americans will develop it during his or her lifetime. Texas has more cases than most other states. Skin cancer will kill almost 10,000 Americans this year alone. May is Skin Cancer Awareness Month, and we've asked dermatologist Peter Maloof to talk with us this morning about protection from the sun. Good morning, Dr. Maloof. Uh, good morning, Deborah. Most of us seem to understand the dangers of the sun, yet far too many of us, Dr. Maloof, still believe that a tan is healthy. Why isn't this message getting through? Well, I, I really think it's a lack of awareness. Uh, most of the people that are aware of this kind of cancer in my practice are in their 70s. This kind of cancer really affects more people in their 30s and 40s. So I think it's really important to educate our young people about this cancer. Yeah, I get that message out earlier. We know there are three types of skin cancer, squamous, basal cell, and melanoma. That's the most serious. So in that one, Dr. Maloof, what are the signs to watch for? Uh, melanoma is a very serious form of cancer. Um, Really, the best shot at uh, surviving this kind of cancer is uh, if you have a family history of melanoma, have fair skin or several moles, it's very important to watch for changes in these moles. So-called ABC rule of melanoma still applies. A stands for asymmetry, that is if you draw a line down the middle of the lesion, if it's different on both sides, it's asymmetrical. B is a border change, C is color variation, and D is a diameter greater than six millimeters. Those are pretty good rules to, to stand by. Pretty good rules to stand by. And also, it, helping us prevent it are some very common sense tips that we can all incorporate in our lifestyles, aren't there? Very much so. Uh, this cancer is preventable, uh, or one of the most preventable uh, risk factors that you can uh, focus on is the avoidance of the harmful rays of the, uh, the sun and uh, mainly between the hours of 10 and 2. Uh, most people that have had a melanoma have a history of increased and excessive intermittent sun burning in the early years of their life and so this is where it's important to educate our young people. You and other dermatologists throughout the North Texas area want to help us with that early detection. Talk a little about the skin screenings that are going to be happening tomorrow free. The, the skin cancer screenings that happen every May are sponsored by the American Academy of Dermatology. It's a great chance to uh, get a free skin exam from a board certified dermatologist. All right, Dr. Maloof, thank you very much for joining us thank this morning. You.